We'll guide you through how to connect a USB to your iPhone 15. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So it's important to note that your iPhone 15 has got a USB-C port. So USB-C is sort of a recent port on iPhones. It used to be a lightning port, but USB-C is actually slightly easier because some USB sticks are gonna be USB-C. So if you have got a USB-C flash drive or USB, you can plug it straight in. But as you can see here, I've got a USB-A USB flash drive. So therefore, I'm gonna need an adapter for this. So this is the adapter I use. It's just a USB-C to USB-A. I'm gonna go and put a link down below to adapters just like this on Amazon. These are affiliate links which support the channel and no extra cost to you. So once you've got this adapter, you just plug one end into your phone like this. And then what you can do is go and plug the other end into the port like this. And that's it, you've now connected your flash drive. Now you may go and get a pop-up saying something like, the iPhone does not have enough power. This means that it is just taking up too much of your iPhone's power and it's not gonna be able to go and connect. And so you'll need to try and use a different flash drive. But once it's connected, we can then go and open up the files app just here. And then if I go and press on browse on, in the bottom right, as you can see in locations, we can now go and see the USB. I could go and click on it just like this, and then I can see everything that's on it. And if I want to go and transfer anything to the USB or things from the USB to my iPhone, then all you need to do is go and select files you want to go and move to or from. To do that, you click on the three dots in the top right here, then tap on select, then select the files you want to move to or from, as I said. Then down here, you can go and press on the copy button, which looks like a folder. So click there, and then this menu will open and you can choose where you want to copy the files to. So I'll press back there and then just go onto on my iPhone and I'll just go and put them here and I'll then press copy in the top right like so. And then if I go and click on browse or back in the top left, I can then press on on my iPhone and here they are, they've then been copied. So it's that easy to connect a USB to your iPhone and use it. If you found this useful, then please leave a like.